So we're back at Bobby Island today here in Belgium, uh, the park where uh, my theme park passion actually started. Uh, today we're here because Revolution is refurbished and season pass holders like myself are actually able to have an exclusive ride time today from 10 to 11. So I'm really, really excited to uh, check this out. I'm very hyped because yeah, Revolution is like, a, it's like an icon here in, in Belgium. Really, really looking forward to see what they have in store with the new refurbished Revolution. All right, so we just entered the park here. We're walking to a uh, revolution because we're going, as I said, for an exclusive ride time here for uh, season pass holders. I'm here together, joined by Matthias here. What is your expectation? Nothing. <laughs> That's very clear. <laughs> No, uh, I, I'm not sure what to expect. Actually, it's it's uh, it's an old ride. I'm not sure how they're going to uh, modernize it. If they're going to change a lot, if they're going to keep a lot of the effects uh, the same, we're going to see. We'll have to check it out. Right here we are, Revolution. I see Bobby. I think is he called Bobby? I think he's called Bobby. Yeah, uh, he's standing there, uh, greeting guests. Let's get inside. So that was a revolution. Uh, to be honest, kind of disappointed because it all felt very similar as, as before. I didn't even notice any major differences. The, the station, yeah, the, the queue is, is different. It's, the queue is nicely themed, uh, but the rest of the ride is just a bit of a disappointment. Anyway, uh, let's go to the next ride. I have a feeling everyone in the park is uh, standing in queue for revolution because it's very calm here at this moment, which is great of course. Okay, so we're walking here at the back of the park uh, near El Rio Speedy Bob. But nothing is open. <laughs> there is nothing really open. You see this, it, it says 25 minutes. Can I zoom in? No, I cannot zoom in. Just 25 minutes uh, queue, but yeah, the, the gate is not open as you can see. It's a bit ridiculous. Uh, like uh, Matthias just told me, 
probably every uh, staff member is uh, working at Revolution right now for no reason. <laughs> but <laughs> here we are walking in a park which should be open, which is not open. You cannot even eat. We're just walking here without any purpose, without any goal. They're expecting so much people, they had to uh, hire a mobile, uh, yeah, how, what it called? I'm not sure how you say it in English, <laughs> but there's no one here. I'm not sure what the issue is here, but every ride is closed, it seems, and everywhere these people are still working on the ride, rides. Why do you have a, a winter closure if you're doing all this stuff on your first opening day? Really strange. Okay, we found the ride which is open. It seems that the, the ones at the beginning of the park are open. I really hate this kind of uh, behavior in parks, uh, opening their rides in the back later. But anyway, let's do a ride. I guess it will be Pop Express, 35 minutes. Are we going to really wait 35 minutes? I guess so. So, Pop Express, we waited uh, like half an hour, I think. It's it's a bit better than, for example, the Power Coaster in Pop Summer Pana. I, I kind of like this one. It, it's quite an old one, but it, it's a fun one. It has quite some fun, fun moments. Uh, anyway, we're going to do a water ride now. A wild water slide, a lock flume. Hopefully, we will not get to it, but we'll have to see. The ride closed down because of techno technical issues. It seems to be a recurring theme here today. Uh, everything seems to be closed. But yeah, now, now the rides are open. There's a flying orca. Great ride. <laughs> <laughs> Can you smell the sarcasm? <laughs> uh, we have this one here. I'm not sure what the name is in English. Wa wave swinger or something like that? Yeah, yeah, but, but yeah, yeah, that's Dutch. That's Dutch. You need to eat Dutch. Anyway, <laughs> now, let's uh, check out if maybe we can do like Typhoon or uh, Sledgehammer or Fury or something like that. I don't know. Uh, they will probably close down because of technical issue also, but we'll have to see. All right, so uh, here are the entrances of Fury, Sledgehammer, Typhoon, Fury 45 minutes, Typhoon 5, 50 minutes and Sledgehammer is an incredible five minutes. How is this possible? <laughs> anyway, we're going to do this uh, Hus giant frisbee. Okay, it's a bit strange that everyone is walking the wrong direction. I have a feeling this one is also closed. <laughs> we'll have to, ah no, there's people actually waiting in line. Anyway, this is a giant uh, Hus giant frisbee. A really great one it's here since 2004 it opened here in the park uh, the same year as typhoon in bobby Island here and uh, okie Doki, the junior coaster but this one was still one of the best frisbee rides here in the neighborhood in my opinion
that was Sledgehammer. I really love this uh, Frisbee ride. It's one of the, the, the better flat rides here in Belgium, in my opinion. But in my opinion, the Intamin gyro swings, uh, like for example the one in um, uh, Jux Summerland in, in Denmark, is a lot better. It's a lot more forceful. Uh, it's a lot faster, I think, or maybe it feels faster, I don't know. But also the restraints are a lot better uh, than the ones here from Hus. These are very tight, uh, bulky restraints, while the ones in Jurs uh, Summerland are very open, very free. You have a really free feeling. I'm not sure which ride we will do next, as all the rides here have a quite a long line, as you can see. I'm really surprised actually because I've never seen such long lines in Bobiana for a long time, especially on a day like this. But uh, yeah, we'll have to see uh, which rides are doable uh, when it comes to waiting time. All right, next up, El Rio Rapid River ride. Hopefully not too wet, but uh, from what I can remember, this one is a very boring Rapid River ride. So I don't think we will have anything uh, to see or anything to... Uh, I'm not sure what you're trying to point at actually. <laughs> this, new? this guy is... Ah, okay, the fact that it's... Ah, it's all new. I have key, key, key. Yeah, that's possible, yeah. Does it, yeah. The bridge is also gone. Was there a bridge? Yes. Ah. Okay, there was a bridge apparently. It's gone. It's... Uh, Spectacular news here. It's all new. Uh, it's, uh, it's all new. Okay, they did something actually this year. <laughs> yeah, wow, teaming. <laughs> Very nice. So that was El Rio. A bit wetter than expected. This guy is a bit wet from El Rio. Show it. Yeah, it's it's, it's wetter than expected actually. <laughs> Alright, next one we're doing Speedy Bob here, Wild Mouse, nothing too spectacular. Alright, so uh, Speedy Bob, uh, it was a great ride actually, really, really wild, uh, wild mouse today. I'm, I'm not used to that here because in the past the, the brakes were very harsh and very brutal, but today they were almost non-existent, the brakes. Uh, it was a really wild ride, but it was, it was fun, it was uh, better than I expected. So we're going to have some food here in the lake house this is the only restaurant with a bit of a interesting menu but as you can see it's very very open <laughs> no it's uh, not open at all it's it's a long time ago since I saw this one open I was hoping it would be open today because it's a little bit busier but apparently we don't have that much luck an hour waiting here in this restaurant we finally have our food this is crazy it's so busy today I'm not sure what's happening here but I've never seen it this busy in Bobby Island in the past few years but anyway let's enjoy some food okay and after our lunch here uh, yeah okay dream catcher is not an option we're not going to wait an hour for a mediocre suspended coaster it's really a shitty day. <laughs> it is so busy today that even Okie Dokie here is riding with two trains. I've never seen it ride with two trains actually uh, in the last 10 years or something. <laughs> this is... Uh, this is, yeah, very, very rare. So uh, enjoy witnessing this uh, incredible moment because you're not going to see it a lot. Alright, 10 minutes okie dokie, 
It's one of the shortest lines here, so let's do it. Okay, wild water slide is open. Let's go for a rematch and see if we can ride it now. So that was wild water slide, fun uh, log uh, flume ride. I've done that one quite some times already. Still a fun one, although it's nothing too crazy, nothing too spectacular. I'm a bigger fan of, for example, Terra Magma. But uh, now we're off to do Typhoon, my first uh, Eurofighter, which I did back in 2004. It's also thanks to this coaster I became a theme park enthusiast when following the construction online of this one many, 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 many years ago. Alright, Typhoon, still a crappy uh, Eurofighter, it's very rough, uh, the, the first drop is fun, the rest of it is just crap, uh, total crap, really don't like this one, uh, although it was, it still has a special place in my heart, but uh, anyway, uh, not the best ride for sure. Fury, 25 minutes, let's do it. This one here is by far my favorite ride here in Bobby Island. It's a Gerslauer. I think it's an Infinity Coaster, not sure. But it's a very fun one. You can uh, choose between going forward or going backwards in the whole, uh, whole layout. And it's a really, really a fun one. Alright, so Fury here, this uh, Garoslauer Infinity Coaster here in Bobby Island. It used to be a really good one, it's, it's still a very good one, still the best uh, coaster in the park for sure. But it's very not smooth anymore since this year, not sure uh, what happened. Last year it was quite smooth, this year it has a very distinct rattle at some point uh, during the ride. It's, it's yeah, very strange. Hopefully later we will be doing this one again in the, the other direction, because now we were going backwards. Hopefully that one will be a lot smoother, fingers crossed, but we'll have to see. All right, 
right, we're doing Dreamcatcher here. Vekova suspended coaster. This time the long uh, the line is it's still 60 minutes, but there is no one here, so I don't think these uh, queue times are actually anywhere uh, but accurate. So this should be 60 minute wait, as you can see. Very busy, very, very busy. No, there is actually no line here. I think the, the ride just reopened after a technical issue. But we're going to take advantage of this and ride it. So that was Dreamcatcher here behind me, Vekoma suspended coaster, uh, yeah, crappy, crappy layout, crappy uh, track, it's not a very powerful thing or anything, just a fun suspended coaster for uh, families, I guess. He's not happy with my opinion. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> don't care. <laughs> That's not true. But he didn't like the, the coast. Did you like it? No. No, okay. So, <laughs> very clear. We're not a fan of this one. So, we're going to do Terra Magma here inside, which is another Lock Flume ride. This park has two Lock Flume rides. There are not a lot of parks which have uh, two of them. But this one is indoors. It used to be Indiana River. I was a bigger fan of Indiana River, to be honest. But uh, yeah. anyway. We're going to do... Okay, I don't see Terra Magma anymore. <laughs> We're going to do Terra Magma here behind all this stuff. God, the skew is dark. So apparently this is a 25 minute wait. I don't think that is true. Anyway, let's do it. So Terra Magma, uh, fun uh, log flume ride, but Indiana River is still better. Uh, the, the theming is it just looks a bit cheap in my opinion and on some places. On some it looks good, some it just could be better. Uh, anyway, we are a bit wet. <laughs> a little bit wet. Anyway, we're going to do uh, this one here, which is El Paso Special which is an interactive um, shooting dark ride. Not the most recent one, it's a very old one, but anyway, let's ride it. Let's score some points. All right, so we just did El Paso Special. Uh, I think one of us won. I'm not sure who, because uh, the, <laughs> the system <laughs> because the, the, the scoreboard didn't work, so we were shooting the whole ride uh, just for nothing. So, I won. That's... Uh, I'm not sure, not sure. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> we're going to uh, Fury now again for another... <laughs> so we're going to Fury now for another ride on this uh, little infinity coaster from Gerstlauer for forward rides, hopefully. Uh, hopefully it will be a bit smoother than the ride we had earlier today. Uh, but anyway, let's do Fury. Okay, so we stood in line for uh, Fury. I think maybe 30 minutes or something. Then the ride broke down, seriously. <laughs> but anyway, uh, we left uh, the queue again because uh, uh, Matthias here uh, has to leave. But uh, that's, that's not an issue, of course. We have been to this park so many times already. So... Uh, not that big of a problem. 
But uh, so what did I think of Bobby Hanan today? It was a very busy day and I have a feeling that Park was not prepared for uh, this season at all. Uh, it's just yeah, very long uh, waiting lines. Uh, the, the, the rides were not open in the beginning of the day, which was really strange. Uh, some rides felt like they needed some maintenance, which is strange on the first day of the season. It's just not the best impression today, Bobby Hanland, for sure. But anyway, I'll see you in the next video. See ya! See you next time, Matthias! <laughs> <laughs> bye bye! <laughs>